Hi, I'm going to be talking about Indiba Active and Indiba Active Fascia. So how does Indiba work? Well, it's a technology based on the application of an electric current that's delivered to the body at a frequency of 448 kHz. This is unique to Indiba. The current will pass from the active electrode all the way through to that neutral return plate, which is this here. The effects of this are a faster recovery, and this is due to two effects of so biostimulation and the thermal effects that Indiba can provide. So what's fascia? Well, fascia is a net of connective tissue, and it attaches, stabilizes, encloses, and separates all the body structures, such as the muscle internal organs. So it provides stability and support and protection within the body itself. Indiba has um, a method of work following the theory of myofascial chain, chains by Thomas Myers. Our resistive electrodes are ergonomic and are designed um, to obtain better results with the treatment that when you're using Indiba. So what are our effects? Well, we can release those fascial adhesions that you can get where um, you can feel it in the muscle tissue when you're doing your massage. Um, we also want to recover that connective tissue and improve the muscle elasticity. We can also increase the skin temperature, so it makes the massage more comfortable. That thermal effect gives us the pain reduction. We get a muscle spasm, uh, a decrease in muscle spasm, and we can also improve body posture by using Indiba fascia. So neck pain, what are the signs and symptoms of neck pain? You can have it really local, so it's directly within the neck. More often than not, it's referred a little bit. So those muscles at the top of the neck start going into spasm. Often you start holding your shoulders up and it becomes quite retracted. Um, there's a restriction of mobility, so trying to turn your neck becomes quite painful. You can get nerve compression and it can disturb your sleep. So it's really important that you go to a physio or doctor to be assessed for your neck pain. So what are the effects when we apply in Deba fascia? We get a decrease in um, cervical pain, a relaxation of those muscles that become really, really tight and sore, which then improves our overall posture, because quite often we hold yourself here and we want to improve posture. We can release those restrictions, so we get increased range of movement, so you can move your head more easily and without pain. Often has an effect on headaches as well, with that referred pain coming from the muscles in the back of the neck and referring up. If we go on to actually showing an application of Indiba on a patient, you can take a seat. We always use gloves when we're using Indiba fascia because we don't want the electric current transferring um, into the therapist. We want all of that current to be delivered directly into the patient so you know what you're delivering. This is the neutral plate, so the return plate. So you want to put a little bit of cream on there. And you can do this treatment in sitting, or you can actually do um, it in lying down. So today we'll just do it in sitting. So you sit right back onto that for me. So you want to make sure that the thigh is in contact with the plate. And then we take um, the uh, fascia tool, which are easily connected into the um, tool on a click and connect. And these are interchangeable on the same lead. Okay, so you want to apply a little bit of cream to the area, there we go. If a patient does have jewellery on, you can either remove that or avoid the area. And we want to do slow stroking movements, starting off the treatment. So you can see there how you can really get in onto upper fibers of trapezius, which is this muscle that runs here. Or we can change from this device and move on to one of the others really quickly, connect in. You can see how ergonomic the, the um, handles are on these as well, the tools. And we can start working on the smaller muscles in the neck using that treatment head. Okay. All right, thank you.
So some of the contraindications of using the instrument assisted tools are listed here, along with some of the things that are more specific to Indiba. So of course we have both types of contraindications listed there for the fascia. Any more information that you'd like on Indiba fascia, you can go to our website at indibaactive.com forward slash en.